Come along with me as I set up for my son's first birthday party. It took me a long time to figure out what theme I wanted to go with. And one night I was scrolling on Pinterest and I stumbled across this officially one or our little man is the big one theme. I'm like, yup, that's it too stinking cute and a little fun fact about my husband and i is we both like to fish so this theme was absolutely perfect got some cheap decorations off of amazon i really didn't spend much on this birthday party probably the most expensive thing was the cake cookies and the food besides that this birthday party was pretty inexpensive and also this is your sign that you don't have to spend thousands and thousands of dollars on a birthday party i feel like people just go way above and beyond for birthday parties these days but hey if they have the money I mean, I guess why not, but for me personally, I don't have the money, but I still want to make this day special and be creative with it. I also saved a lot of money because I only invited our close family and friends, and then also we had it at our house. We didn't have to run out a venue or anything like that. I mean, maybe one day in the future, if my kids want to have a birthday party at a bounce house or a children's museum or anything like that, then maybe it's worth spending the money, but for right now, in this day and age with my kids it's not worth it they will feel the love no matter where their birthday party is and also when i said i like to be creative for birthday parties i should have reworded that because i'm not very creative shout out to pinterest i pretty much found all of these decoration ideas off of pinterest so yeah if it wasn't for the good old pinterest and amazon i would have been screwed for today i also told myself i was not going to do a balloon arch because they are a pain but i just love the look of balloon arches in the background for like the cake smash so the labor is worth it maybe <laughs> My fingers were pretty sore at the end of this, but I got it done and it made this space look so much better. And what you're about to see is an outfit change because I definitely did not set all of this up in one day. I swear this doesn't look like a lot of work, but I spent all day the day before his birthday party decorating and getting everything ready. That's also another perk about having birthday parties at your house. You can decorate the day before and not have to be so stressed out in the morning trying to get everything around. So setting up the day before definitely helped relieve some of the stress in the morning. So in the morning, I just did the final touches and got all of the food out, the cake, the cookies, the snacks. And one thing I definitely do splurge on for birthday parties is getting professional like cake and cookies done. They always turn out so cute and everybody loves them every birthday party. And obviously the cake smash is also important so i had to go all out for that the baker i use always does such an amazing job and once again cake turned out absolutely perfect i also was going to blow up our big water slide but i decided just to keep that in storage and just do a little kiddie pool with some fishing rods but yeah everything came out so good everything came together could i have spent more and made this party more extravagant could i have spent less on this birthday party and it still would have been a great turnout also yes but i personally think that these cheap amazon decorations just made this space look so good everything just turned out so so cute now he's only one and he won't remember this day but my family and friends and i will that's all that matters and i truly can't believe our little man is the big one Happy birthday!